A man who has spent years helping people in the community now needs help staying afloat. His food pantry in Broomfield risks going under because of rising costs. Olivia Young reports on his efforts to raise enough money to stay open. After 20 years, a small family owned food pantry fears they may have to close their doors because of rising costs. I didn't think it would ever be this big. Um, we serve approximately 400 families a week. Brian Decker and his wife Marilyn founded North Denver Cares Food Pantry in 2003, along with families from their church. Why we started this was our goal was to serve people and to make sure that people that needed help got help. Now the pantry is the one in need. It's not just the cost of food, it's the cost of all of our expenses. Like for instance, rent fuel has tripled in price in the last year and a half. The same price pressure driving families to their door may force those doors to close. We're uh, running short on operating expenses. Decker is applying for grants and fundraising online, hoping to raise $40,000 to stay open through next year. He says 400 families are counting on them. I'm um, optimistic that we're going to reach our goal so that we can stay open and keep uh, serving the people that we serve. After 20 years, 82-year-old Decker still spends his days working in the pantry. We take them around and we start here. But Marilyn has passed away. My wife uh, went to be with the Lord about five years ago and she is gone. The couple shared 58 years of marriage, five children and one calling. This was her uh, first love. She really uh, cared for the pantry and cared for the people. Decker says the best way to honor his love is to carry on hers. To learn more or donate, visit NorthDenverCares.org. In Broomfield, I'm Olivia Young, covering Colorado First.